Hey everyone, how's it going? Robert here, and welcome back. Today I'm playing Security Booth. <laughs> Man, did I say that weird? <laughs> Today we're playing Security Booth, which sounded even stranger. Today we're playing Security Booth. I am a security guard for Nova Nexus, and I am not letting anyone in that's not supposed to be here. If I could get my mouse to work, I had it working for a moment. Alright, I actually had to reopen the game. Here we go. Which is good because I actually like that intro. Again, with like the PS1 style games, that's pretty legit. I like that a lot. Um, you know what? This is doing it again. I, after like the fifth time, I think I got it. I think, I think I figured out how to get in here. The game kind of eat your mouse. So then I figured out, you know, like the A and D do this, but I could not figure out how to get in. I thought it was the mouse click, but it's not. It's E, kind of like it is in other games. Fret not. We are back. We are in the security booth. Nice. I like the feel of it. See, not now I can use the mouse. Job rules. Make sure to talk to the person in the car. They must work here. Check person's license plate in front of their car. If the person's license plate is on the employee register, let them in. If they are not on the register, you must tell them to leave. Only keep the gate open to employees. Keep gate closed until you've checked the person's ID plate. So let's see here. Do they work here? Check the license plate, which we could verify that in the book. And just, just keep the gate closed. Five pages? Great night. <laughs> Great night we having. Good things to come, I think. Mind letting me in? Uh, oh, what? What? No, no, no. Can I? Can I just? Can I ignore the conversation? <laughs> yeah. It, you know, it's it's literally the first. Okay. Okay. Well, actually, actually, let's let's see here. G twelve sixty nine R. Uh, let's see here. G twelve. G12 69R Stefan Oprasan. All right, yep. Welcome. You may go in. I thought that dialogue choice was just going to be the end all. Like, you may go in, and the game does it already. All right, so I'll go ahead and close that bad boy up. I mean, can, can you imagine, like, what like what a job this is? Be sitting here, waiting, out in, out in the woods. I already feel weird in the house if there's, like, a window. Not open, but, you know, like, there's no blind over it. I feel like people could see in very well. It's, it's like, I don't like that feeling, so I feel like this would be a, rid a little ridiculous. Leo and 31. Uh, check real quick. Leo and 31. Louis Woodhouse. Ah, uh, quite night, but that's nice. Today feels like it's gonna be hell. Let me in. I don't know if I actually have to talk to them or not, but uh, you may go ahead, Louis. But do you know what I mean? Like, if you have the blinds open and, like, the w like windows peering in and you have, like, light on the inside, I just feel like you could, like, you don't really know what's outside and you could be seen. I just feel like that's pretty much all this is. I mean, everything's pretty well lit. But you just really have no idea what's going to happen. Do I, do I have somebody to call? Am I going to have, I'm probably going to have, like, both these lanes. I wish they would stop a little bit sooner. 
good boy. <laughs> uh, I have a feeling this is one that's probably gonna. That I'm gonna have to tell them no, but I'm not entirely too sure. Let's let's see if good boys on the list. I just feel like the name implies. I don't know, George George Phillips. All right, you know what? I'm not even. Let, let's try not even talking to you. Just just go straight in. I wish I could carry the book out with me so then I can actually like check it. But this isn't this isn't bad, you know. Just sec security guarding it up for Nova. Nova Nova Nexus. The Nova Core. Security guard security guarding it up for Nova Core. There's probably going to be both of them at some point because why else would they give me two of these buttons? I'm a little bit curious on the phone though. And I probably actually should be checking, uh, like actually talking to the people. It would make sense. Mm, NT2 M28. Actually, I think it was T8. Let's look for M28 because that sound kind of distracted me. Like. I don't know, see there's M28, but it was definitely... Let's look for any other M28s. Uh, I don't know if there's a time limit. I'm reading through all the book. Uh, I'm not I'm not sure. Good. You can go to heck. I'm pretty sure this is X. Yeah, like XT2. You could... F off, buddy. Night shift again? I hear that. No doubt tonight will drag on too much. Not for me, at least. Uh, can I go in? Um, I'm not letting you come in. Oh, they're actually they're actually turning around. I didn't know if they're gonna, <laughs> if they're able to ram me. Look okay, at not not even fighting. He just uh, just just turned around and left. They thought they could get me with weird sounds. Maybe a little bit. Error code. Zero. Five. Zero. Four. Seven. Okay, five, seven. four, seven, seven. Error code. <laughs> I'm sorry. The caller you connected to cannot be connected to. That was kind of dumb. I don't know. And let's see if we can hedge this guy off here. Uh, AU8, 7UI. 7UI, Ellen Brown. Come on in. <laughs> Milady. I'm sorry, that was just, that was just bad. Do I need to talk to you? I don't know what the light flickering is about, but dude, whew. <laughs> I was gonna say, the car just flipped and disappeared. I don't know if I'm going to need to remember that code. I hope not. I mean, there's really no... There's nowhere for me to put it. Ah! <laughs> Who? Oh, 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 snap. Okay. So I just have a, a creeper out there watching me. Maybe it's the guy I told to told to shove off. Mm, FA five, A forty eight. FA five. Was that person Andreas? I think. Okay, here you go. Have a good night. I'm gonna go see what this is about. I can't even go. I can't even go that far. I am. I have my limits as a security guard, and that, that right there is one of them. This right here, one of them.
the excitement is a rush. We're so close to finishing the experiment. We have had a few accidents. Someone called Natasha died last week, but it's worth it in my opinion. Did, did I say that right? Someone called Natasha died. Someone called Natasha died? Someone called Natasha died. Someone tip tapping on my glass. That that sounds like a whole lot of my not my job. System failure. System failure. All right. I don't know if you want to go over there, sir. Um, DE4. T93. Sure, let's look for T934. First. T93 first. Hmm. T93. We're just gonna ignore all the other sounds for right now till we uh till we scan through these numbers first. You know what? I'm uh, I'm actually not seeing it. Sorry, buddy. You're probably the creeper from before. Um, I'm not letting you in. I'm sorry. You know, I would I would have gotten a phone call if somebody from like upper management or something if you were supposed to be coming in today, and it, we're just gonna ignore the fact that I can't get through the store. And you know what? That explosion it might not be best to go uh, to work anyway. <sighs> Ever since Natasha died, man, it just, things haven't really been the same. Hmm. Not one legit phone call. They they kind of got me a little bit there, you know. I wasn't expecting a handprint this time. Hmm. The director is still running tests. I'm going to shoot him if this goes on any longer. I mean, what you do, whew, what you do in your own time, that's, that's kind of not my problem, because my, my thing is the security booth, and you know what, that phone's going to have to wait. It's going to have to wait. RE8031. So, no, right there, too. Uh, let's see, RE8031. Uh, you know, I can ignore all sounds, RE8031. Do, 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 do. It is. Who is that? It's Natasha. My girl. Oh my gosh. I mean, we might have two in Natasha's, but girl, we thought you died. <laughs> that experiment last week? Boy, that was a banger. Yeah, you know what? Again, that, that sounds a whole lot, a lot like not my job. Emergency. Emergency. Lockdown system activated. Security weapons activated. Oxygen level reducing. Your families will be informed of your death. Emergency. Hmm. Emergency. I mean, hopefully not mine. I'm I'm just a security guard. Oh, I'm letting people out. That's it. Huh. You know, I didn't even read this note either. If the director keeps running his goddamn test, we'll never get to open classified with classified and classified. It would only take a short amount of time to complete. 
do I, do I have to check you out? Do I have to check you out? Do I have to shut that door too? Let's shut that door because one at a time. Ah, <laughs> oh, I like that. I like how they have their names and them in it as well. It's pretty good. You know what? But that was actually pretty good. I enjoyed that. I really enough, it was kind of fun having that element of uh, checking people in and stuff. And they did have like some spooky elements, like whenever you're reading the book to check the people in. It was uh, not gonna lie, it was, it was a little intense because you're trying to read it and you hear like this knocking and tapping going on. And uh, you know, I was just trying to do the best I can as a as a security guard. You know what? Let's actually let's go for it. Let's go for the second ending because it said in the description there were two of them. So let's actually let's actually try it out. Let's try it out. And to try it out, since this time, you know, we're just gonna let we're gonna let everybody in. I'm not even gonna look. Let's just good day. I mean, that has to be the other ending, right? Like, if I do an ending where I let everyone that was supposed to be in, compared to if I just let all the wrong people in, it has to be the second ending. And we're going to keep a lookout for anything else that happens along the way. And nope. There you go. I wonder if you actually stop. I mean, I guess you kind of have to because the gate's a little bit slower, but... And I'm not even going to look. Have a nice day. You know, let's pre-open this door for you. Going across all the bumpers. Boop, 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 boop. No problem, sir. You have a you have a good one right this way. <laughs> all right, so let's uh, let's see what happens. You know what this game does kind of remind me of a lot. It reminds me of um, a paper papers please. Just the fact that you have to like verify stuff. I know Papers, Please, you have to verify a lot more information than what you do in this one, but. And I saw it. Here, we're gonna let, we're gonna let this guy through, and I'm gonna check out this note. See if it's anything different. Uh, nope. Same thing, got the call. Natasha died last week. All right. Nope, no problem. We'll see you. You have a good one. I mean, you wouldn't really be here if I, you know, if, if you didn't belong, right? Like, who wants to break into something like this? It'd be ridiculous. There you go. Although, I do kind of wonder if the handprint on the glass, whenever that occurred, I wonder if that means I did let somebody that wasn't supposed to be there in. Is this the, the guy that just stands there? Yeah. Greetings, hello. You uh, come to watch the security guard a little bit? Yeah, look, we're gonna let you in. Hello. Oh, sorry. Let me get the door for you. Man, am I dumb. I was, I was clicking the mouse. I wasn't even hitting the E button. Have a good one. I'll see. Uh, I'll see you on the other side whenever you whenever you exit. What? Okay. Yeah. That, that's what I thought. Go. Go get out of here. This ain't some kind of show. This is my job. I'm a security man. You know what? There's probably somebody coming soon, right? They wouldn't have me uh, sit around for too long. Let's go ahead and uh, pop this door open. It, it, it takes a while for it to open, so might as well. A note in the back. It's a threatening letter. All right, let's see here. System failure. Hmm. Go on, just, just go. You're good. You're good, sir. I recognize that blue car anywhere. Just keep on looking straight. It's not my job, not my job. What happens behind me? My job is in front of me and on the sides.
I guess technically somewhat behind me if I'm letting people out. But. Just one. Just one handprint. At least this time, anyway. Did I... I did not look at this one. Or I did look at this one. Oh no, come on. I need, I need to let this guy in. So, oh, it's not, I recognize your vehicle. You're Natasha. Just, just come on in. Come on in. Welcome. Welcome back to work. We, <laughs> we, we, we thought you died. We thought you died. I'm, I'm so relieved that you're back. Come on in. Come on in. Come, <laughs> let's get on in there. Maybe she didn't want to go in. Oh. I don't think I remember this note, actually. I'll answer that in a second. Finally, the experiment has been improved. I'm so excited. I feel that classified will really change the company and the world for the better. Maybe. Maybe. Do I have to let that car out? Is that the other ending? What if I just completely don't do what I was going to do? Let's close that too. All right. Let's uh That's right. My my oath. The line. The line I am sworn I cannot cross. Darn. did it. We did it. By not doing our jobs, <laughs> we did it. But honestly, that game was pretty good. I enjoyed that. That's that's pretty nice. It had a little bit of the like spook elements in there. I mean, it was a, a spoopy game, and I would definitely agree with that. It did have a little bit of spoops. But thank you guys again. And if you like any of my videos, feel free to like and subscribe. It helps my channel a ton. And I actually forgot to say this about the other videos, but these games that I am playing, the link is in the description below, just so, in case you wanted to check it out. But thank you guys again. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.